just going to be interviewing a couple of people. I love Skins. Skins is the best. Everyone. This show is like so big. We just just everyone it. that loves Skins. It's just everyone. amazing. Do, it. do you like the skin? Of we course I do. Skins. Naomi has ping tings here. I'm Anna B, this is What's Up, What's On, and I'm here with some characters from Skins. Hi, I'm Leia, and I play Liv. Hi, I'm Sean, and I play Nick. Can you um, tell me something about your character role and how, um, what kind of character you play in, in Skins? Um, I'm from Bristol, and uh, Liv is, she's pretty, quite, she's quite outgoing. Um, she's quite ballsy and loud and kind of boyish and quite dirty as well and she's kind of yeah I think she's maybe you could label her maybe as maybe the kind of cool one of the group the party head do you think you relate to her in any, any way um I definitely have like aspects of myself that are really like Liv I think maybe she's she's kind of me to an extreme I think Nick's a sort of rugby captain of the school he's sort of alpha male boisterous arrogant confident in himself ambitious um he goes out with a hot girl in school as well, Minnie. Not to be too American prom king, prom queen thing, but um, definitely that sort of uh, alpha couple that should be together, not because they want to be, but because they feel it's the right way to do it. But actually, he's a lot, there's a lot more to him. You know, he's, he's massively kind-hearted. He just doesn't always bring it forward in the right ways, and um, he's genuine. We've got it like set on like Sky Plus from reminder because we don't want to miss any episode. What's been your favourite act so far? Um, <laughs> oh, my horses! <laughs> I couldn't even choose. Midnight Bean! <laughs> relate to the character in any way? I think I do relate to him in, to an extent. I mean, uh, the, the competitive side of things, the ambitious side of things. I mean, I loved my sport when I was younger as well. I played a lot of rugby when I was younger. So um, I understood that sort of aspect of his life and the sort of the, uh, the companionship that he felt with his rugby boys. But there are aspects of him that I don't see. You know, he puts up a face a lot of the time and he, and he seems to sort of, anything that you think of him now, later on in the series, just he kind of smashes their pre, those sort of preconceptions you have of him. Do you think you've learnt much from playing the role like her? Uh, yeah, definitely. I mean, playing any role has definitely made me more confident within myself. What do you think of the storylines that she's got given? Uh, yeah, they're really fun to play. I mean, it's stuff that I would never do or have never done, so it's, some of it's quite out there. And I don't know, to be in that position and to be able to get away with it, because it's actually you know, not real, that's the kind of fun part. And uh, what's it like working on the, with the cast and behind scenes? And Oh, it's amazing. It's good fun, man. We had six months of madness. Uh, Skins is the kind of show where you sort of um, you have to make sure that the sort of banter and, and, and relationship you're meant to have on camera is, is sort of replayed offset. I think it's massively important that you get along with the people you work with, especially on Skins where the relationships have to be so real and so relatable. The chemistry has to show on screen. It has to be there in the background. So, um, yeah, we had a good laugh, you know, six, uh, six to eight kids in the hotel at one time, you know. Um, living in Bristol, going out, doing it, you know, it was, it was an amazing thing and we all enjoyed what we were doing, so yeah, it was great.